What's up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode 14 of our Pokemon Legends of the Arena Demo Explorer. In the last episode, we had just taken on the Ironside Village Tournament, defeating that on our first try. Our brother ran away like a wimp, and we met Laura in the cave for some one-on-one -on -one time, if you know what I mean. In today's episode, we are here in Taproot Town, where we just made, I do believe the next leg of the tournament happens here, but my fingers are crossed that we have some story before that. So I do hope you enjoyed today's episode. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. If you are, go ahead and let me know by either hitting the like button down below, uh, or answering our question of the day, which I don't have one yet. Uh, but anyway, sit back and enjoy today's episode as we jump in. Like I said, we just got here to Taproot Town, so I think if I remember correctly, we spent a lot of money in the last episode um, to get our items. Yeah, it would appear so. Okay, cool. So that means we're gonna... Okay, I'm gonna go down there last. It's locked. Okay, I was about to say, don't let every door be locked, please. Sorry, can it wait? I'm about to head out into the desert in search of fossils. In search of fossils, nice. So that means we have some fossil story coming up. If you're thirsty, then grab a drink from the saloon. But be careful, there's ruffians aplenty in there just itching to start a fight. Sounds good to me. Uh, we're going to be leading TK. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of people. You should be careful here, mister. Plenty of roughnecks looking the battle. We have to think about this structurally, fellas. They're ruined, so we got to put up some sort of beams or we'll get trapped. What the heck do you want? Now, why Flight of the Bumblebee is their choice of, uh, why Flight of the Bumblebee is their choice of music in the saloon, I don't know if I understand that, but. This thing just used ancient power and got the boost. That's kind of wild. So anyway, we're on, what is this, week, week three maybe with this series? Yeah, so it's episode 14, so. We're on week three of this series. I don't know how much is left. I assume we're still a ways from being done. Uh, but as I said at the beginning, I hope you're enjoying this series. Uh, I appreciate everyone that's taking the time to check it out. Our next series will also be a demo game. But I think we're going to start going into fake mon. Oh, there's our question of the day. Do you know of any... Ugh, you're going to have to know of any to answer this question. But... What is your favorite game that has fake mods? I don't really want to name too many because I don't want to. I don't want to give away what it could be. North has to be the way to go. It's quick and easy, and there's less chance we'll get caught in a sandstorm. Hey, are you listening in? Yes, I am. So anyway, there's a whole lot of games that have fake mon, and I do think that's what we're gonna probably aim to do. Uh. There's actually, over the next month, I think that we're going to be starting three new series. I think all of our series are going to be coming to an end in the next uh, couple weeks. All of our current series will be coming to an end. So we've got some, some new stuff coming to the channel. Geodude. I'm going to switch for a couple reasons. One, Geodude might body me. Two, there's a future site on the way. I would imagine this Oko's. But he has Sturdy. No, oh, not Siri. Did I just get hit by Future Sight? I didn't even notice it. I didn't even notice it. Also, I've been thinking about going back to our randomized Nuzlocke series. I've been thinking about it. I've been thinking about it. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Dang. What are you gonna do to me? Oh. I think that just puts you in range of death. Peace! You know, I should do... No, I shouldn't. 
I was thinking I should do something like a uh, Dragon Ball series, because I was thinking of like what I do with my time when I'm not sitting here recording. And most of the time, <laughs> I'm reading the uh, Dragon Ball manga I just started reading. Look, I think we should take the eastern entrance. Less chance of a cave-in, you know? Do you mind? We're trying to have a conversation here. Hey, that's not my fault. I didn't do anything. I wonder what these guys are planning. Are you poison type or are you flying type? So you have to be poison. What the heck am I saying? He's not poison type? Question mark? That's gonna hurt. In an effort to save myself, go to cast. I want to figure out what type. And that's exactly what I thought was going to happen. Hey! Okay, he's ground flying. That's weird. I don't know why he's not... Uh, I don't know why he's not poisoned. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. <clears throat> ground flying Gligar is. Interesting. Alright, let's take on one more battle. Let's put... Let's let Wally take this one. I think our team will be, well, all the matters that we find the fossils, then we'll be rich. Excuse me, young man, but you're intruding. Is this what we're supposed to like train up for to be ready for the next tournament? I really wish I had a water move. When do I learn a water move? What? What? I guess I'll go here, because I don't have anything else I can go to. Um, Alright, I'm just going to look and see... What? I'm going to look and see when I learn my next water move. I think I looked at this already, but I don't remember. Wait, what? Oh. Some of these websites, okay, so. I don't learn a water move until Aqua Tail. So that means I, I need to get Surf. So it depends on when I get Surf, that makes sense. The thing with the music in this game is it's really good, but It's not so good on the whole repetitiveness. Can't a freelance musician enjoy a drink around here? Hey, I didn't stop you from enjoying your drink, guitarist Kurt. Uh... I guess going here is the- well, I guess one of the- one of my two strongest is the play here. Why'd you crit me? I wonder if Surf is gonna change in this game. I wonder if Surf will change because all the other HMs became useful, but Surf is the best, well, Surf and Waterfall are the two best HMs, so I wonder if they changed in this game. I also wonder how soon I get Surf, because I kind of want to be... I kind of want my uh, Feraligator to be useful. But as he is now, he's not so he's not so useful. Is there a priority move that's special? Is there a special priority move? Yeah, Pursuit, Sucker Punch, Mock Punch, Bullet Punch... Shadow Sneak. The Metric? I guess I'm gonna go here and see if TK can get some experience.
Yeah, perfect. That'll, that'll work. Oh no, don't raise your attack! Whatever am I gonna do? Oh, shoot! Okay. Oh, if I would've flinched there, I'd have been upset! I can't think of a uh, special physical move. Yes, we can learn Calm Mind. Okay, I'm gonna stop being lazy and just get rid of Teleport. That's actually a... That's a great thing to come across. Alright, let's go to... I guess I'll keep Wally up there. He said, he can see my future and all he sees is defeat. All right. You got it, bro. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna doubt you. I mean, I'm a little, I'm a little concerned now, to be honest. You think I'm gonna suffer defeat? So who am I suffering defeat to? Does that happen like later on? Not today, right? Because you ain't beating me. <laughs> okay, he lied. Okay, that's good. That means that, that will be good. All right, for this double battle, I'm gonna go heal one more time. And then we'll take on this double battle. So far, this episode has just been nice and calm. Not a whole lot to talk about. Just playing the game. Playing the game. Like I said, the only thing that I do outside of playing games is... Hold on. We've been documenting environmental changes out in the desert. Boring, really. Makes me want to battle. Oh, are these individual trainers? Oh. <clears throat> so the only thing that I do is read the manga. Read Dragon Ball manga. It's really good. If you're a fan of Dragon Ball and you haven't read the manga and you haven't watched the whole series in a while, you should definitely check out the manga. The reason I say that is because it's pretty much the exact same, but it is a little abbreviated in some places. In some places it's a little abbreviated uh, just because it's more like a book rather than Wow, he literally said, oh, I could have stayed in and just used cut. I totally forgot that I had cut. Ouch! I feel like Swift got a boost. I feel like Swift got a little boost a boost. Seems like that did a lot of damage. Meryl, Meryl! All right, I'm gonna go back to Wally. I don't know why, they're both level 33. So currently I'm looking potentially for a new water type. I don't know, I kind of like using Wally, but... Alright, Cass, this last one's on you. Cass has fallen behind. My colleagues here won't stop complaining about his- or my colleague here won't stop complaining about his job. He needs to man up. Colleague? If he's your colleague, then why are you sitting on the same side of the table? Well, that isn't gonna work. Um, TK should be able to handle this, assuming I don't get killed in one shot. Thank you. I feel really good about the team that we have here, but I'm I'm concerned for the levels that we're going to be facing. Oh, I didn't do half. Ouch! That might be just enough. Oh, use double edge again. Don't crit. Thank you. Nice. Nice and experience. Pidgeotto? I got some for your Pidgeotto. Let's see who the better flying type is. Let's go, Cass. Oh, Cass! Cass is.
What does it want from me? Oops, I forgot to move this. I always move this. Oh! I hope it didn't light up. I don't think it did. Have you ever considered becoming a Pokemon Ranger? Did you hear the timing on that? The timing on that was flawless. All right. Welcome, how may I serve you? I just beat everybody. You're gonna give me something. All right, this is a hundred. This is 80. Oops, no, stop. I wasn't done. All right, that'll be good. Now we got, we got potions. Nice. Did any of the bo those Pokemon really stand out as a threat? I don't think so. I think we just rocked through everybody. I just don't want there to be a tournament like in the next episode. You look like a trainer, my friend. Are you here for the tournament I expect? Well, may I make you, what say I make you a proposition? What kind of proposition? Would you like a rare and strong beast to aid you in your advance? Or I have an egg acquired from lands far away which should decimate all competition. It shall co all it shall cost you is 20,000? That's a lot of money. I shall make an exception. I shall sell for the low, low price of $19,999. No. Let me know in the comments below if I need this, if you know what it is. Um, I, I don't... I don't know what that is. Stop everything and look at the screen. This is amazing. This is really cool. You're looking at a TM and it tells you who can learn it. That's awesome. Before you even buy it, it tells you. Let's go. Let's go Legends of the Arena. Calm Mind, Light Screen, Safeguard, and Return. Wait. Oh. No. Facade is the one, and I have Facade. I just need a Toxic Orb. Oh, you're cash. You have to go for it a little harder if you do. Yeah, what you don't know is that Mozilla is right here. What? Alright, well, Floramon... All right then, all right then. Nah, I'm good, I ain't I'm not trying to EV train out here. I'm the Pokemon Move Maniac. I know every single move Pokemon can learn leveling up. I also collect rare bones and bring on a teacher move one of your Pokemon. If the Pokemon is learning to come back with a rare bone. My oh my, what a wonderful day. We are truly blessed to have such weather. That's what I'm saying. Baby said gurgle. Have you been to the museum yet? You should visit the museum. Why should I? There's like bones and stuff, if that's your thing. Tournament, ass. Shorts are appropriate clothing in this kind of weather. Comfy too. Thank you. I've got sand in my running shoes. Life isn't all fun and games, you know. Is this where I came from? I think that's where I came from. Have you been out to the desert? I've always wanted to visit the ruins of Al Moor. Museum. Oh, God. Welcome to Taproot Museum. Enjoy your visit to Taproot Museum. Children are welcome here, although their interest may be in rocks is debatable. We assure you that all the artifacts we collected here are real, so please refrain from touching them to validate this. The Pikachu. It's a statue of an ancient Pokemon. No one has been able to identify it. Can you name that Pokemon? Wow, check it out, it's so historical. What is it anyway? It's like a rock, man, with holes in it. They call those meteorites. Children, take notes. This is a meteorite. Apparently this probe was found in the middle of the desert one day. No one knows where it came from. Strange stuff. Ah, museums are butt. I personally like museums. Look, son, it's a golden sphere thing. Doesn't it look cool? It's all a conspiracy! Oh, I really, I was hoping he was going to go off. Uh, 
Yes, the stone tablet inscription about the prophecy. It's in a foreign language, but I think it reads... Domino, there you are. I was told you wanted to see me. Yes, Domino, I've been talking to an old friend about you. His name is... Professor Oak. It's... Oh, Professor Oak, it's a pleasure to make you to meet you at last, Domino. Pleasure's all mine, I'm sorry, but I can't say I've heard of you before. Ha! Huh, that's a first. Professor Oak is a famous Pokemon professor from a faraway land. His work on the Pokedex won him multiple awards and lots of money, of course. Oh, Gabriel, you flatter- Oh, shoot, I almost had his voice, hold on. Oh, oh, Gabriel, you flatter me too much. But I'm more interested in how you're doing, Domino. I heard about what happened with you and your brother. That sounds rough. I don't know what you're going through, but remember that you did nothing wrong. This is your journey. No one should try and take that away from you. Not even your brother. In fact, I've seen many kinds of... Many kids like yourself overcome hardship like this, and most of them do well. I think, anyway. I forget. Who are you again? Domino. And thanks, I guess. No problem, my child. I must impart my wisdom elsewhere. I'm sure there are some eager ears down at the local saloon bar. I may even impart my wisdom in a little shot-sized glasses, yes. Good luck in the arena. Professor Ock would be a brilliant professor whom we could not live without if he wasn't drunk all the time. Drunk? Yes, he's practically a celebrity among the scientific community. Shame he doesn't cope with fame well. Well, at least he's a happy drunk. Indeed. Now, Domino, I suppose you're wondering why I wanted to see you, apart from receiving my advice from a drunkard, of course. What do I have to do with this? Barter the pirates, scale a cliff, brave the perfume department. Dear God, Domino, I'm not that cruel. All I want to say is you should go with Laura and Michael into the desert. They said they were going to look for some ruins. Sounds like fun, really. Is that it? Apparently so. Make, your, make sure you're back in time for the tournament and have fun. Well, I'm down for that. That sounds like a... That sounds like a darn tootin' good time if I if I say so myself. What was that? What's that guy's name? It's not you've seen. It's uh, Gabriel. 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 All right. Before I go any further, we are going to save our episode and end today right there. Today we did exactly what I was hoping for, exploring all of Taproot Town. Next up, we're gonna head down into the desert with Laura and Michael. So yes. Not a tournament right away. Hopefully the desert takes us a little while to go through. Because we just had a tournament in the last, or two episodes ago, whatever that is. Let's have, let's have some space in between. But anyway, I do hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, let me know by hitting the thumbs up down below and answering our question of the day, more importantly, which was... It's right above me. I don't remember it right now, but answer it in the comments down below, and we'll see you in the next episode. Until then, spread some positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.